Yes. Dude, yes. Okay, let's go. I don't feel like I'm alternative. <laughs> I feel like I'm, you know, I feel like I'm hip hop. Uh, forever losing faith in my motivation. Emotion vacant. Know these ankles breaking from no skating across your face. Hit the speed of rant like we Sonic Chase and we can't relate. Ultra magnetic, like Zeke say, yo, control your fate. And all to say, the side to say is always more than Charlemagne's and what's their names and crying about the squadron name. If you love making music, people will love hearing it. And if you love it that much and you want enough people to hear it, then it'll find a way. I'm a big believer in reincarnation. So I think like, you know, well, no, you, you know what you just revealed low key? <laughs> like we got some branding now, right? You can switch that nine and a six to a six nine, you know what I mean? Catch a vibe with it real quick, hold on. I just think what I've realized that makes it easiest and best for me is just music that I can play and that I can enjoy and that brings me that tranquility. You know what I mean? For my whole career, up until now, I've been a YouTube type beat fiend. <laughs> it's like Goodwill, you gotta get the cleanest thrifty thing. The beats that you don't find on YouTube are the beats that I'm trying to get on. <laughs> There's a mix between you want a super flamey beat, but you want one that doesn't have too many views in that same swing. Nowadays, it doesn't matter what the view count or what, like if it's hot, like if I can hear it, let's go. Yeah, bro, low key, that's like bar for yeah. bar, like my friend. <laughs> um, I'm a poet first, right? Like it, it starts with the words and then the beats matter. You know, we want to make good songs and we want to make good vibes, but mm -hmm. it all deviates from the vocabulary and the words. I took six years of Latin. I love my Latin teacher, shout out Miss Maynard. I think a lot of the time we get into ruts because we try to force it. Mm -hmm. And one thing with poetry is that what I've learned is you can't force anything. My biggest thing was I needed peer influence, um, motivation, an engine, a self-sustaining engine of people to help influence. And so it's all been networking and like just keeping each other motivated, keeping each other fresh. What it comes down to is just that um, really just coming together with dope artists, dope creatives, collaborators, and just creating dope waves. Folks like yourself, Quiet Fire, we got our uh, all platforms collab. 2022 we all have something that we want to bring to the table let's bring these ideas together let's share this art let's share the craft if you can get in the plug you can blow up overnight low key just on some random you know what i mean what you put into the universe is what you get out i came up with something on instagram quiet fox man i think that's a good because like the the f and fire like quiet fire like it already flows a little bit we can like talk it. about it later we're sitting on a gym right now, um, and we got more gyms to come. We're scheming. We'll be talking soon, and look out for the Austin Fox, Quiet Fire Beats collaboration. Maybe Quiet Fox. We'll, we'll, uh, we'll talk about it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll talk about it. <laughs> Stay clear of all opposition. Oppers doubt in the loft of griffins in our position. Cop the vision, but not in the scriptures. Hippopotamus dentures, over ambitious go-getters have my belly swollen. Anonymous slithers leaving my soul with it.